Now, very shortly, we will be introducing the five finalists. But before we do that, I think that it is fitting and proper this time to meet the people who have spent two full days evaluating all of our contestants in order to come up with this year's winner. Now, the judges' decisions are not always popular, but please understand that their decisions are based on their own tastes and expertise of who will best represent New York in the Miss USA pageant, which takes place in Miami. And once again, please remember that it is not the individual, but the cumulative totals from each of the three competitions that brings us our winners and our runners-up. And we believe that this year's panel of judges offer wonderful credibility to a very, very difficult task. So ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to introduce to you our judges. Beginning with the executive director for the Saratoga Springs City Center, Mr. Mark E. Baker. The president of Schwartz Public Relations in New York City, Mr. Barry Schwartz. The casting coordinator of Procter & Gamble Productions, Susan Scudder. The president of J. Merkel Productions of New York City, Mr. J. Merkel. The president of Mediacom in New York City, Mr. Virgil Scudder. The Vice President and Manager of Commercial Casting with Darcy Macius Benton and Bowles Incorporated of New York City, Ruth De Pasquale. And the News Director and part of the popular morning team at PIX 106 Radio in Albany, Mr. Bill Sheehan. Our lovely Judge's Assistant, Pamela Seitz. Also, our official tabulator from the associate, an associate in the certified public accounting firm of Rosenfeld, Helpman & Shields, Mr. Paul Shields. And also the president of Sports Entertainment Media Corporation, Mr. Seymour Seitz. Also in our audience today are some special people that we'd like to acknowledge. Would you please put your hand together for the area director of the Capital District, Louise Boyka. Louise. The personal appearance director of Miss New York and Miss New Jersey USA and Teen USA, Brenda Grennan. The former Miss Finger Lakes region, USA, Jane Pompiano. Jane. Uh, the executive director of the Massachusetts, Maine, Vermont, and New Hampshire Miss, U uh, Miss USA pageants, Mr. Mike Wasserman. And his two associates, Master of Ceremonies and Choreographer, Harry Stratos. And his pageant coordinator, Terry St. John. Terry. Also with us is the general manager of WXXA-TV in Schenectady, Mr. David Lowe. David's around here somewhere. There he is. David was pulling an all-night business deal last night. Thank you, David. And also uh, the special projects coordinator of the Felt Forum of Madison Square Garden, Mr. Mark Albin is here. Mark. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, for being with us. At this time, I would... Thank you. Uh, sorry. Uh, Joe, uh, well, I'm, I'm one of the judges, but I felt, even though this wasn't part of the program, I felt uh, that speaking on behalf of all of the judges, and ladies and gentlemen, uh, we've spent more time with these lovely young ladies than all of you have over the last two days, and I just wanted to say what a, a special honor and privilege it was for all of us to get acquainted with all of them. They're all winners, and we thank you. Thank you. And
also in the spirit of honesty, uh, since all pageants must be conducted without any question of any improper dealings, I must confess that there is a mistake in your program. Um, on this page, it, it's, there's a photo of Joe DeRose as Master of Ceremonies and Nicole Barth, the wonderful choreographer. And underneath there, it says Entertainment, the Stewart Brothers. It shows two fellows. There's uh, one fellow there with uh, curly hair. That's me. <laughs> and another rather pink-cheeked, fuzzy-faced little guy. That's Seymour Sites. Ladies and gentlemen, the Stewart Brothers. <laughs> Only in America, huh? Seymour Sites and Barry Schwartz, the Stewart Brothers. Well, in honor of the occasion, since we'd like to have a little fun right now and the votes are still being tabulated, we thought we would celebrate the spirit of the occasion since this is part of the Miss USA pageant by saluting perhaps our most exotic state and taking you all on a musical journey to the island of Hawaii. And you get a standing ovation from these lovely ladies. Not only are they beautiful, but they're smart. <laughs> Terrific. Uh, now, Seymour, you, you're involved with the pageants all the time. For, for me, it's only occasionally I'm, I'm flattered to be invited to judge. So, to kind of celebrate for me, is that okay? Absolutely. I have the stage all to myself. All to yourself. I'll just stand over here. I, I can do a solo. <laughs> Old McDonald had a bar. Now, 
McDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on this farm he had a dog, E-I-E-I-O. With a <coughs> here, <coughs> there, here, <coughs> there, everywhere. <coughs> old McDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Now old McDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on this farm he had a cow, E-I-E-I-O. With a <coughs> here, there, here, there, everywhere. Brothers, ladies and gentlemen. 